a warm welcome you all today we are going to discuss about thermal breakdown presented by professor m jibin assistant professor department of electrical and electronics engineering rohit college of engineering and technology thermal breakdown when an insulating material is subject to an electric field the material gets heated up due to conduction current conduction current and dielectric losses due to polarization the conductivity of the material increases with increase in temperature and the condition of instability is reached when the heat generated exceeds the heat dissipated by the material and material breaks down this is thermal breakdown graph the graph drawn between temperature and heat various heating curves corresponding to different electric stresses as a function of specific temperature assuming that the temperature difference between ambient and the specific temperature is small newton's law of cooling is represented by a straight line the test of specimen is at thermal equilibrium corresponding to field u1 at temperature t1 as beyond that heat generated is less than heat lost unstable equilibrium exists for field e2 at t2 in order to obtain basic equation for studying thermal breakdown let us consider a small cube within the dielectric specimen with site delta x and the temperature difference across it faces in the direction of heat flow is delta t therefore the temperature gradient is cv into dt by dt plus k into d by dt into dt by dx equal to sigma e square e is the electric field the solution of the above equation will give us the time required to reach the critical temperature tc for which thermal instability will reach and the dielectric will lose its insulating properties however unfortunately the equation can be solved in its present form present from cv i cv comma k and sigma is all functions of temperature and in fact sigma may also depend on the intensity of electric field therefore to obtain solution of the equation we make certain practical assumptions and we consider to extreme situation for its solution this is the thermal breakdown thank you